Oh lordy! Slipping. Big reach. Big reach. about kicking that plate. There you go. Feel a little better? That looked like smoke, dude. Look better. I want all the smoke. What? I want all the smoke. You don't want no smoke, dude. <laughs> Pop that plate. Better. Reach, reach city. I don't think that jump, power it. Now do that, but delay the trunk. Got you. I got you. There it is. That? It's good, dude. It's a, there wasn't a lot of drive on that. It was a mouse click, mouse click. Oh yeah, it's better. Uh, huh? How's that one? Caleb, how was that one? What? How did that feel? Didn't feel like I really, like, feel like I just spun it. You look more linear on that one, though, and you got a little bit of a click, yeah. We've got Mr. Spinner over here. No way. Come on, dude, I'd pass two been Mr. Spin. <laughs> Cutter City. Gosh. Mr. Spinner. Mr. Spinner. Cutter. <laughs> Mr. Cutter. Mr. Spinner. Is there anything on that? Um, the plate didn't pop, and it was just a lot of. The, when you guys spin it like that, it's because your trunk. There's no linear motion in your trunk. Your trunks are just spinning off. So you're cutting on the ball. That's right. why it spins like that. That's what I thought of the last Right. Two. So that's just exact. That's the, I mean, the other one, there was a little bit of a click and it looked a little, there was spin, but it, that one was no click and a lot of spin. So it's gotta be, it's gotta be the linear drive, the separation, but then the trunk is also a linear motion. So as that trunk goes, launches forward and that front leg is helping support it, that's what gets that linear spin so if your trunk is just staying upright and you're just cutting it it's always going to spin like that 
No spin. That's the linear power. No spin. Linear power with the rotational complement. Shout out Adam Garcia. Actually, shout out Kevin Schultz. Yeah. It's like everything is everything is sequenced up good. It looks money, but the li linear, the linear power. I'm a bum. What up? I'm a bum, basically. No, bro. Huge bum. Bro, conqueror, dude. More than a conqueror. Yeah. Got the smoke. No, oh, baby. No smoke. No smoke today. No smoke today. It's hard. I hear you. You guys gonna lift? Yeah, we're gonna go get food. Come back. Respect. Same stuff. Here. Respect. See you boys. It looks like the back leg is just rotating though. From there, I mean, it's getting through. Like that hip is through and you're separated, but look at the glove side started to pull. And then that's, I can't see the next frame, but that can lead to hyperangulation. So if that glove side is gonna open up like that and that arm is gonna drag through, it can be hard. So you're going, you're driving, there's drive there, but then it's just kind of rotating through. The hips are all the way open and that arm is kind of dragging. Look at all that. So if that trunk goes more open and that arm drags through, that's rut row. And then you're stabilizing the front leg, but then look at the trunk. It just is, see how it just stays up like that? No. So there's a lot of good things, but it's just that linear power. It's getting the hip through, but there, it's not like drive extension, linear energy. Cause if there was linear energy, it would hit the front leg and that trunk would go forward. So it's not bad, but it's just like the same thing we're seeing. Like you got to start mixing the, the med ball throws and these, because you look, you look really good and dynamic out of the back leg on the med ball throws, but it's just not quite there with the baseball yet. And as soon as you get those two synced up, it's there, dude. Like that 45 mile per hour intensity with the med ball into the baseball. That's like, I mean, I, don't, I, I, I wanna say it's like low, low 90s touching 95. If you could do that consistently, like just consistently be there, which would be freaking nasty as a starter. You're the man. You're the man, bro. No way. I'm trying to get like you, dog. No way. I'm trying to get like these guys. Sphinx. Studs. You gonna throw? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. All right. What are you doing? In a break, two last set. Did it? Fine if I do more like on RDL days, do more single leg work because like my single leg, like I'm terrible single leg. Yeah, I'm always fine with more single leg work. Cause yeah, cause like, like I can't even jump off like 
one leg at all. And so my like, single leg sucks. I mean, five. <laughs> the strength. Five. Oh, obviously, but are you doing any plyometrics off one leg? Not just the conditioning. Should I do more like box jumps off one leg and stuff? I mean, you don't have to do a ton. But just so, add them in. Yeah, I yeah. mean, you could you could contrast train it where you're doing like, say like single leg lunges and then pair that with, um, I mean, there's all kinds of stuff. You could just do single leg vertical jumps. You could do single leg bounds. You could do uh, ice skaters, like oh, yeah. do them in all different planes. Got it. That'll help a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna tie that into. I'm gonna try to do organize. But you know, you know what it is, bro. Yeah, that my weight. You know Train what it is, bro. Five. Dude, I'm with you, man. I lost a bunch of weight, so that's why I'm back, back trying to lift some weights. You know what I hate about lifting weights, bro? You lose if you don't do it. Well, that. But they're so dang heavy, dude. They're freaking heavy. When I, was, when I got 172, and you you took my good bar, dude. I love this bar, man. This is totally I, good one. Everybody <laughs> loves that bar. I got Mr. Crooked over here. <laughs> it's so uneven. I, I know. That's what I'm saying. It feels so weird. Steve, you can have it. I have like one more. I have two more sets.
Hunter, give us a little bit of your story, bro. Yeah. Been a long haul. Long haul? Yeah. Getting ready for this season? Yeah. Big expectations? Of course. What are you thinking, man? Just trying to go make a team. I don't know. I hear you, yeah, bro. It's even like 10 days. I know. Ugh. No way. What have you been working on this off season? Just trying to get stronger. Man, a little weight. See if I can move a little bit better. I hear you. I'm the main man, Stephen G. Good things coming? Yeah, of course. Hope so. That's the plan. Don't hit me now, bro. If my man can throw a two-seam at me, maybe so. <laughs> Cambio. Look in uh, one of those boxes over there. There may be over there. That boy. Change up. Doesn't read spin. Still like Javi though. <laughs> Infielder at heart. We'll catch some pitch grip releases. That would be huge. <laughs> I got you. Uh, come on now. You've never played catch before. Uh oh. I trust you, bro. I trust you. That hard, though, is for sure, though. Whatever. Change up. Okay. Fired up in there. Okay. There she is. It's nasty. 